Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are continuing on with this boat, and as you guys can see, we are still moving from the previous video. I haven't actually stopped, so what we're going to do today is, I think we're actually going to go ahead and try and put something in this room in here. Uh, we need beds, we also need some sort of, wait, actually, we still have this, by the way. These are the controls for this thing, which is a bit odd, that's very strange. Uh, but yeah, we need a bed in here. We also need like a med bed and some other things as well. So I think that's probably what we're going to do today. Let's go ahead and get on with it. Let's grab the boat, send it back, and hopefully this will be good. So yeah, I'm not very good at interior design. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm really not good at it. But let's put some beds in and hope for the best. Here we go. Bed. We're going to make it white for now. And we're going to put it right there. Okay, in fact, can this be like different rooms? I know it's already like one room, but what if it was multiple? Okay, so let's let, let's do that there, and then say we have a med bed bay, med bed bay in the middle. Um, somewhat like this, yeah, I guess that works. Send uh, a little bit of a pole upwards, yeah, I think this will be fine. I think this will be fine, excellent. So we'll have the med beds there. We'll send this room. I guess it's gonna go across here, which is weird, but there you go. And then we're gonna do this. Actually, no, what we will do is we'll add doors here. So door to the, yeah. Okay, we're gonna add multiple doors. Sliding door, we're gonna have one to the bedroom. There you go, and then we'll have one to the other rooms, which is like this. There we go, excellent. Now this will be fine. So then we attach these all together and hopefully this will all be okay. All right, send this upwards. There we go. Send this across there like that. There we go, and finish this off at the top. Brilliant. There we go. Okay, cool. So we got a room that has nothing in. We got a bed right there. We've got a med bay right here. Uh, let's put a little bit of a, a leg under there. Excellent. And there as well. Brilliant. And then we'll paint these red. Because it's a med bay. I think that works. Yeah, cool. So we got a med bay. We have bunks. And then we've got we've got no equipment room on this boat. I mean, like the equipment room is up here, but not really. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Um. We could add some equipment in here, I suppose. So let's do this in these rooms. So we're going to go for some equipment. All right. So we need fire extinguishers. Yes, we'll have them on both sides of the ship. There we go. Excellent. We need a welder. We need that on both sides of the ship also. There we go. Why does it always go in upside down? That's weird. So welder and thingamabobby are already in. We're going to have a flare gun also upside down for some reason. And flare gun ammo. There we go. Excellent, that totally works. Uh, first aid kits, always very good. Also upside down. So one there, one there. And we'll seal this off like so. Bam. There we go, that's probably brilliant. We then need some first aid kits inside of here as well. We do. So let's delete this wall. And we'll put first aid kits all the way along it. There we go. Yeah. What do you think about that? Brilliant. Okay, uh, why is it all in random? Why is it always like random? It's so annoying, actually. There we go. Excellent. That totally works. Uh, we also need more equipment. So we're going to need some diving gear somewhere. I don't know where to put it. <laughs> There's actually legitimately nowhere to really store this. Uh, let's send this across there. And I think that'll be fine. Okay, so the equipment is actually going to go outside. The equipment like this, diving gear, can go right here. So I'll have one diving gear, we'll have two diving gears, and then we'll seal it off. Uh, just like this. Uh, with these pieces. There we go. Flip it over. Put it there. Put it there. I think that's brilliant. Yeah. Totally works. Good. Uh, we're also then going to put this right here like so. And we're going to put something under that. I don't know what should be under that. Maybe some rope. Yeah. We'll put rope there. Alright. Cool. So that actually totally works. We've got a little bit of a, a first aid bit right here. We've got first aid in here. We've got some equipment here as well. We've got a little bedroom. Excellent. Uh, and I think that's actually completely fine. That is awesome. How much room do we have down here? We could maybe make this a room too. I don't know how, but we could. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll leave that for now. Uh, back there. That's okay. Um, all right. Good. I don't really know what else to do. Oh, let's do the top bit of this. So I think we should have like a bit of a spire again. Let's hope that this works. So we're going to do this up like so. We're then going to do it down again. Um, over here. So we're going to do this. Excellent. We're going to seal this off together pretty much. Like that, excellent. And then we're going to do this upwards, um, like so. And we're going to put this piece on the side. 
And I would say that looks somewhat cool, actually. I think that works. Don't know what's going to go up there, but some stuff could go up there, I suppose. We could have some lights and stuff. We could have some, like, random bits of this. There we go. That looks pretty cool. And we'll attach them together with this. And back there as well. There we go. We'll also actually do it here, too. Do -do 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 -do. Right there. Awesome. Uh, and hopefully that'll be pretty cool. I like that. That looks good. Let's actually paint it a different color as well. So for the front bits and the top bits all the way across. There we go. And then this bit all the way up there and all the way out here. And the same right here. There we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that's awesome. I might actually do the rest of this too. Um, at least little bits of it. That looks good. Little bits of this as well. That looks pretty nice. And maybe we leave it somewhat like this. There you go. That looks cool. I like it. Nice. Um, spotlights, we've already got those on the boat, so we don't need to do anything with those. Uh, I would like some rope anchors somewhere. So, rope. Let's do it. Here we go. Rope anchor. We'll put one right here. Uh, attached to there. We'll put another one right there. Attached to there. And we'll paint it the same way the other one was. Excellent. We'll then have to attach the rope to something. Uh, we will. That's weird, actually. I have to attach the rope to something. That means I have to build something. Okay. So we're going to do this upwards. So there. We're going to grab some rope and we're going to put it up there. And yeah. Even though it seems a bit odd, I'm sure it's got some sort of use. There we go. Attach those to it and let's see what happens. Rope. Attach it to there. Attach it to there. Brilliant. This has only been built on... Oh no, it's been built on both sides. Let's attach this to there and there as well. What does it look like? What does that look like? Yeah, I mean, I don't mind it, I suppose. It looks a bit weird, but... I'd say that that's a cool thing to have. Which is weird, I suppose. It's just something random that makes the boat look a little bit better, I think. Um, well, maybe. Maybe it looks better, maybe it looks worse. Who knows? Anyway, let's do this down. Uh, to there, excellent. And we'll leave it like that. Good. Yeah, I think that works. Alright, so let's save this as the mothership. There we go. Uh, and let's sail it around a little bit. Let's go. Is there anything sunken near us? What's this? Let's go. Let's go do an actual uh, visit to somewhere and see if what happens. Let's go. So open this. Do this. There we go. Go. All right. So we're gonna go do a visit uh, to the rocks. We're gonna actually disconnect our submarine, make it go down, dive. We're then gonna go for a little diving exploration down there, and then we're gonna dock back up to the ship. That is our mission today. Seems weird that we went from building to actual, um, an actual exploration, but that's fine. All right, let's have a little look around while this is happening. So, obviously this right here is still fine. We can have a little hole right there. Uh, I don't know what else to do with this deck at the back. Um, some of you have said that we should have a helipad. I, I don't want a helipad because a helicopter will weigh this down way too much. The submarine already weighs it down a lot. Um, so yeah, that's the thing. I'm going to close that up. Let's go down here and have a look inside here. So the lights are obviously in every room. Um, yeah, like that. There we go. Med bay. I'm not very good at interior design, so we're going to have to leave that somewhat like that. And then another room right there, and then we can get outside right here. We need to move the controls for this. We genuinely need to move the controls for that. Um, yeah, so if we disconnect this and we press out... We can actually keep our ship connected, our submarine, and that will be okay, because then the electricity will still go to it. However, the other problem that I think we're going to have is I wanted to use that winch on the back uh, to connect to this, but you can't connect two winches together. So we need to add a block that's connected to that that will do the same job. So we'll probably do that eventually, but for now, we'll leave it as is. Alright, cool. That's actually awesome. Very, very nice. So we're going to wait until we get out there. We are 5.6 kilometers away. We could actually just get in the... We could just get in and go. To be honest. However, because we are still moving, that's a bit of an issue. In fact, yeah, that's a huge issue. Uh, what's the battery like on this? Okay, so the battery is full for now. I guess that's okay. Let's test it out against some waves, shall we? Here we go. Wind, 50%. Let's see what that does. Okay, let's get inside just in case. Da -da 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 -da. There we go. Close the door. Okay, we, we somewhat rise out of the water, but it is somewhat stable. That's good. Alright, increase it to full. 
Okay, it flies a little bit. But honestly, it's not too, too bad. That's, uh... That's alright, yeah. It's stable enough to actually stay alive, so... I think that works. Nice. Alright, take it back. Take it off. There we go. Because we need to get to the rocks to have a little exploration. Uh, and I think that'll be good. Yeah, it's going to be good fun. Is there anything else that we need on this? Is there anything else that we really need? I think being able to get down into this front bit would be cool. But again, I don't actually know what we'd store there. Um, yeah, but there is actually room enough for something down there. So that'd be cool. Also, we have these. Whoop, whoop. There we go. Spray. Yeah. If there's any fires, we can put them out. Brilliant. Um, okay, awesome. We're still 4.4 kilometers away. It's taken a little while to get there. In fact, it's taken ages to get there. So annoying. Uh, right, what does this do? What happens if I press this? And then I disconnect this. Okay, right. That was a bad idea, it seems. Winch up. Can I actually winch it in against the current? Is that going to happen? I don't know. I don't know if this is going to work. We're going to keep trying to winch it in. Okay, let's try and slow down the boat and see what happens here. Let's go. Da -da 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 -da. How fast is the boat going? 13 still. Awesome. Right, okay, so we're going to slow down the boat. We're going to do a diving exploration to the bottom of the ocean right here. We're not actually going to go to the rocks. Um, and we're going to see if there's anything on the seabed. So there you go. I'm going to leave the ship on. I'm going to leave it as is. Let's dive on down and see what happens. Let's go. Da -da -da -do -do. So we leave the ship running somewhat. Uh, I don't know how the heat is going to work for that, but I'm sure it's okay. And da -da -da. Oh, you know what? Actually, wait. Before we go down, we need to actually winch down a lot so that it is actually loose. Otherwise, reconnecting to it is going to be a pain in the butt. So there we go. We'll leave it like that. Excellent. Good. All right. This should work. Let's see. Jump inside. Whoa. Wait. Whoa. <laughs> I'm trying my best. It's not really working out. There we go. Good. Close this up. Open this up. Very good. Close this up as well. And disconnect it. Let's go. Release crane. Let's go for a diving exploration, guys. Let's go. So push this down. We're going for a diving exploration. Weeha! Nice. All right. Remember, we are actually still connected to the main ship. So in itself, that's a bit weird. Um, but it is okay. So turn these on. Turn this on. And our battery is being used. But I figured that the main ship might actually be good for that. All right, let's have a little dive around. Let's see what's going on down here. See if we can reach the bottom of the ocean. Oh, wow. The bottom of the ocean is actually quite far away. Hot diggity dog. There's a fish. Oh, have we seen that fish before ever in our lives? I don't think so. I don't think... Oh, what's happening? Okay. Are we almost near the, the, the ocean? The seabed? Oh, I rammed the seabed. Okay, so what happens if we need to, like, emergency back out of here? How do we do that? Because ballast out won't work down here. So if we wanted to get up to the uh, seabed, we'd just do this. Alright. Let's say that our submarine, for some reason, floods. We'd, we'd put this on. We'd get a first aid kit. Maybe even two. And then we'd jump out. So here we go. We've got it already coming up to the surface. Let's open this up. Excellent. Let's swim out. Let's get ourselves to the surface. And we'll see if we can pull it all the way up. I think we might be able to, but I'm not entirely sure. So we got to swim all the way up. Where's our ship? I need some under lighting on the ship as well. That would be actually excellent. That would be really, really cool. Uh, I don't know if I've been moving. I can't tell. I don't even know where I am. I don't actually know where I am. But we are. We're trying to get up to the surface. Let's just fly up. Meow. There we go. Excellent. Where's the ship? There it is. So let's get over to said ship. There we go. Very nice. Release the equipment. Because it's making us blind. Good. And then we're going to go up here. We're going to go inside this room. And then inside this room. Turn this one off. And this one on. And let's see if this raises our submarine all the way back up. Because I think that's how we rescue it if, it, if it sinks. There it is down. Oh, wow. We can actually see it from here. There's our submarine. That's awesome, actually. That's that's incredible. Yeah, so our submarine will actually get pulled all the way back up. Because this winch still works. 
The other thing that I do want to check is how's the battery on the boat. I don't have any generators on the boat, but yeah, battery's still fine. So I don't think the electricity is actually being given to the uh, submarine, which is a bit odd. But there you go. So that's fine. I think it is slowly. It's loosening the slack, or at least it's making it better. So that's all good. Yeah, it should eventually just pull it in. Awesome. I might have to do something with this as well. Because this airport at the minute just stucking in the sky. Stucking in the sky is not right. Yeah. Anyway, it is pulling. Because uh, I feel the ship moving. Which is weird. Let's, uh, let's start driving forwards. I think that will help it pull it up to the surface. So let's go. Forwards we go. There we go. Awesome. And it should pull the submarine up to the surface. And here it comes. It might be upside down actually. It is. It's upside down. It's a bit of an issue, that, to be honest. It's a bit of an issue. But, there you go. Totally works. Anyway, uh, for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed whatever the heck this was. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.